Northern Territory, Mother Nature is in charge, and she has to be respected. Take it easy there. But sometimes, a little dynamite can nudge her along. We're going to need it about a foot deep, Randy. A day after they found the dynamite, the Barks family and the Grizzes have gathered at the 70-foot-long beaver dam that's blocking this frozen river. Time to dig and time to blow things up. They need to blow out a channel, or Grandpa Grizz's property will flood come spring. How much time is there after lighting that fuse? This old fuse is unpredictable. We're going to plant one stick on top of the other now that we got that deep. I'm going to put this one down first. Carefully. And when I drop this one in with the fuse, when this blows, the bottom one's going to go too. It's been a long time since I blew a beaver dam. All right, maybe you should let us get in the Kubota before you light that. Go ahead and get in. I'll wait with Grizz. Get in and start it. All right, let's go. All right, go, Grandma Grizz. Go, go, go. Keep going. Keep going, keep going. That's good. We far enough away? We're plenty far enough away. Big boom. Big boom. Come on. Come on. Ah! Look out! Wow! Oh, ah! yeah! Yeah! Wow! It worked! Ah! It worked! It the old dynamite thunder, didn't it? Wow! Yippee! <laughs> wow! That was awesome! That's how you do it, buddy! <laughs> That was faster than digging. Wow. He's flowing. Oh, look at it bubbling. Uh, that's good. Blowing up a beaver dam with dynamite? That's success bush style. Now come spring, our cabin will be safe. That's what we were after. Nice and dry. Thank you, guys. Sons of Winter, Tuesday at 10 on Discovery.